I'm known as Sandy at the Art Centre. Um, I've been doing pottery or ceramics here for three years. I'm in um, Alice Battis' class and I really enjoy doing especially bowls. I really love doing the bowl shape and doing um, special designs at the moment. I'm really into um, hummingbirds. I think they're great just the way they fly around and they've just captured me, the hummingbird. So um, this, is, this is done on stoneware and it's called Matsumo Brown and I've done the birds in um, leech turquoise which have come out quite, quite well. Um, it was accepted for the show and I'm thrilled with that. My name is Audrey and I do the zigzag snail and I do this when I was seven years old at St. Monica. And my teacher, Mrs. Corrado, um, she assigned us to do this project and I thought it was really cool. And you, she taught us how to draw the snail and um, then she said to make anything on the background and I thought it would be cool to make little zigzags with lines and swirls all around it. I'm Brock Sagan, and um, I've been taking classes here since it was the Art League, since it was way back when, and uh, I started this, this uh, series of the Historical Society, um, and this is one of them. <laughs> And I've been taking, I take drawing, painting, ceramics. I still take classes because, well mainly drawing classes because I never want to lose that ability. Like it takes practice to, and you have to stay on it to, to, to draw well and draw from the figure well. And so that's why I do it. Hi, my name is Colin. Um, I took classes uh, at the IOT three years ago, and uh, yeah, I created a dog um, here, and uh, yeah, I made it individually, so um, yeah. I choose it because, well, one, I had uh, all the supplies ready, and uh, yeah, and also I just um, felt like making a dog. It just, and I cut myself a lot while dealing, dealing with the sharp edges right here and uh, so yeah and then um, around the body right here it gets really thick so it's hard to bend and yeah I have been taking our classes here ever since I can remember the classes I took are glass blowing, pottery, drawing, sewing and painting and um, I really like it and I've been in the art show for many years and that's it so um, this is my skirt that I made all tied up with joy and I don't know really how I got it I just kind of put them together and I'm really happy how it turned out and how it like made its own like ways and curves and yeah so that's basically it about that. I first started taking art lessons at the Art League on 34th and Penn and then that didn't last very long and then you know I had the babies and moved on and then uh, when my children were little, I started taking printmaking, and my first major influence was Marilyn Price, and she taught me all kinds of printmaking, and from and I, then I became so interested in all paper products that I did etching and intaglio, wood prints, woodcuts, uh, what whatever. And then there was a long hiatus, and I have started again about two years ago. Nobody in the class does anything that is not wonderful or, or has some kind of merit to it, and this has worked with me. And I've been there about 
with her about two years and this is my, my new piece and my piece was hand built uh, I can no longer do anything on the wheel I don't have the strength for it so it's torn pieces of clay smoothed together and fired in a wood kiln I love wood kiln uh, effects and thank you for interviewing me I'm probably the oldest one in the show. I won the Michael McCormick Award for my picture here, and which this is my third time taking digital photography, and I love it. And uh, I love taking digital photography. And I took this picture when I went to see my brother in Colorado and and I was like I was telling him to go ahead and go go quickly to get the picture so that's what I did and then I photoshopped it a little bit I won for best in age group um, and I won for Desert House. Um, I've been taking a couple classes here for drawing and they're just really fun and I've enjoyed them a lot and they've taught me a lot of things um, about art and what the true meaning of it is. Um, I really started to enjoy art um, when I was six, seven, eight. Um, because the Art Center inspired me to do art. And so I really enjoy it here. I've been here at the Art Center for one semester. Uh, so I'm in the beginning of um, watercolor class. Uh, I've also wanted to take, I'm gonna take some sculpting classes. Uh, I've done sculpting and art and drawing and painting on my own all my life. And so this was one, a piece that I, that I did uh, uh, actually before I started the class earlier this year. Uh, and I'm in my 40s now so I hadn't drawn in about 10 years and, and wanted to see if I still had it one Saturday morning and voila. <laughs> I won um, for uh, best of the beginner group with my etching Dahlia and um, it's my first uh, print making class here at the center and it's been a lot of fun. We have a great great group. I've always wanted to try printmaking and um, ended up having the most amazing teacher here. Patrick is incredible and I also love that there are printers who've been printing for 20 years in our class and then there's me who's beginning and so I have learned not only from Patrick but from every student will help me you know with my woodcutter or the etching and I'm learning from everybody and I, I just look forward to Friday every every week so love the center I entered the show for the first time ever and with a drawing of my mom and I'm taking a class, a beginning class with Gloria Fisher and it's drawing on the right side of the brain. It is the best class I've ever taken in my entire life. Um, I took one other acrylic painting class and really realized that I needed to know drawing before I took additional classes and as I said, it's just the best class. She's a fabulous teacher. and. I think everyone in the class would agree we've learned more about our abilities than we ever would have thought possible. So it's been great. Uh, I'm taking a ceramics class. This is my second one here at the Art Center. My second one anywhere. Um, and the piece just sort of came to me. I've been experimenting. I didn't want to make coffee mugs and plates. So I started doing some sculptural pieces and entered this in the show and here it is. <laughs>